so uh, i think everyone uh, is aware about the kerala floods uh, not everyone uh, so the 2018 kerala floods was a severe uh, flooding uh, phase in kerala that resulted in 483 death uh, uh, death and uh, 19000 uh, uh, crores of damage uh, so uh, the story that i'm going to tell is about the website that you can see here kerala rescue that i started uh, which helped uh, a lot of people in kerala uh, to uh, get uh, rescue them in the flood situation uh, so Uh, i'll be just skimming through the blog uh, it, at august 11th uh, there was a small uh, flooding in my place and i, I just thought of having a uh, website that could help the volunteers uh, in organizing uh, the relief activities uh, after that uh, in 14 hours i just uh, made a quick website in jango and just uh, hosted it uh, in heroku uh, after uh, uh, some time uh, like the volunteers was able to uh, do relief activities and at uh, later at august 15th uh, the flooding became very severe and as you can see uh, this was the levels of uh, severity and uh, uh, first of all we uh, first we started receiving uh, re requests uh, like for 10 liters of water and food then this is a request in our uh, regional language i'll just trans uh, the translation is here me my newborn and my fa uh, father mother and my uncle and my aunt are trapped in our house the ground floor is flooded we can't escape we are out to our house is near the pamba river water is water level is increasing dangerously please someone help us so such severe request started to come in and i started receiving help uh, from the on online open source community Uh, so a slack group was formed about 2000 volunteers 2000 software engineers different from different parts of the world who don't even know about us uh, started to help so in a week we had like uh, our github repo uh, received 500 stars and like 100 contributors in total so this uh, uh, website was used to uh, rescue people stranded in the flooded uh, sites like the gps location was uh, sent from the mobile phones uh, using the uh, gps uh, javascript api and uh, the, those details was given to the government and most importantly the, uh, the kerala government made this the official site of the uh, for uh, for the rescue activities uh, so our stack is in uh, jango gunigon postgres and redis and um, this uh, this was the result of open source philosophy and uh, the government introducing edubuntu in every class in our government institutions uh, so uh, basically python and open source saved kerala thank you if you are interested just read my blog just google for uh, at the eye of eye of the flood and i don't think at the eye of the at the eye of the flood medium just google for that and i don't think i served uh, justice for what the community of us was in this 3 minutes please read it thank you